Hi, my name is Elsie Wilson. I've worked at Fishwicks for 36 years. I was secretary to John Brindle. I've done the accounts, I've done the wages. Um, it's been a lovely company to work for, obviously. That's why I've been there 36 years. Uh, John was a fabulous boss. We got on well, so well together. Um, I understood him, he understood me. Uh, we had good days, we had bad days, with some laughs. There were some days I came in and I didn't want to talk because there's days I get up and I think I don't want to talk to anybody today, but John understood that as well. Um, he used to say I was his boss instead of him and my boss. Um, I enjoyed the fact that I could come in in the morning, do my work, John never questioned it. As long as the work was getting done, John was happy and he trusted me to do my best, which I did. Um, it wasn't, he wasn't like a boss at all. Um, I enjoyed meeting all the people that I did, some of whom have been there as long as me. Um, I built up good friendships. They weren't just colleagues, they were friends. Um, they would come and visit me, I could go and visit them, you know, we'd have nights out, have a drink together. Um, <clears throat> perfect relationship, really. Uh, I don't think I've ever fallen out with anybody seriously in the 36 years. That's quite something. Um, I think everybody knows that, you know, my husband worked here for nearly 40 years. And as far as I was concerned, I wasn't John Brindle's secretary, I was a driver's wife. So I understood it from the driver's point of view because my husband had been in the past situation a driver and latterly became an inspector before he retired. So as far as I was concerned, I was a driver's wife and I looked after the drivers the way I would have looked after Jim. You know, i.e. as far as wages were concerned, they always trusted me with that and um, I always did right by them. My favourite memory about Fishwicks is the people. Uh, some lovely people have come and gone. Some are lifelong friends. People have retired. They still keep in touch. Um, there's Rosemary. Uh, poor Mary, she died too soon. I uh, still hear from Rosemary and she's retired I don't know many years. Um, but no, I've made good friends there. <clears throat> John Brindle and Jim Hustler amongst them. Uh, Jim's, Jim's a, a nice man as well. Uh, good to work for. What you saw was what you got with Jim. Um, Jim was very, took his work very seriously, but in out, out, he was a total head case. So funny. Um, regarding the general public, I've been totally gobsmacked by the response that I've seen on Facebook these past few days. It's been totally, totally overwhelming. The support of the public, um, you always have the tiny minority that will say bad things. But I don't dwell on that. Uh, I was on the last bus last night to Preston from Preston. The support from the public um, was phenomenal. Messages that I've seen, um, the people in Leyland are really, really sad that Fishwicks is finished. They've, they've always known Fishwicks to be there. And as I say, it's, it's, going to, it's, a, big, it's a big part of Leyland that's gone. Um, all I can say is thanks to that public for supporting us as they did. Uh, Fishwicks was, I think, everybody's favourite bus company. They would let the stagecoach go past and wait for the Fishwick one. There's uh, clients that took holidays with us. Same people over and over and over again. Um, they have their own memories of Fishwicks. Um, and thanks to the staff for their, their support, their understanding. And 
most of all for their friendship. I'm going to miss them, but I'm going to miss them on a daily basis. But I know that they'll they'll always be there, and um, I'm always there for them. Emily wants to play their cup of tea. You know where else in gym live? Feel free to pop in. It's a sad time for fish rakes, but times move on, don't they? Um, and I'm just glad that most of the staff have managed to secure another job, which is good. I, I, I worried about them. But as far as I can see, most of them are, you know, they're, they're sorted for the future. And I hope they go on to bigger and better things. Thanks very much.